Hello everyone, this is a Freddy 2 here, back again with another tech review. Today, we're looking at the latest from Patrick Kroon, the Mirage Midnight uh, Blue Edition, is it? I think it's called Midnight Blue again, I think for a minute. But yeah, let's check it out. It's uh, the fourth edition, technically. Midnight Blue, if I'm recalling correctly. Let's have a look. Hi everyone, this is Vita Say 32 here. We're gonna look at the Mirage Midnight Edition playing cards, if I recall correctly, from Patrick Kuhn. And what you'll see is basically the same as what you've seen with the previous decks. It says Mirage playing cards. It says Midnight Blue Edition on one side. Premium playing cards made in America on the other. Fourth edition on top. And uh, in the bottom, a little ad copy, check out his website, patrickcoon.com, to get these. In the back, you see the back design basically nice embossing on a matte stock with kind of a white foil, or maybe just a. Well, actually, no, it's not foil, it's nothing. Uh, if anything, it's a little bit of, I guess, what it is, is a UV ink, white UV ink on the tuck case. No seal, and then the flap. Learn now, patrickcoon.com slash secrets. I didn't tell you. <laughs> and these little PIP logos on the flaps. So, nice tuck case. It's a little bit flimsy, in my opinion, a little bit thin. You do get, speaking of learn now, a gaff card with somebody's face on the cord card. <laughs> and basically mirror image. And you also get a another card, not a gaff card, Ace of Diamonds on one side, Queen of Clubs on the other. That looks like Laurel London to me. The Jokers just have that logo. Looks like a bit of metallic -y ink. And the backs, very nice dark blue. Back design, his trademark deck. Ace of Spades is Mirage playing cards. And the court cards, there's some customizations, some magicians' faces on there. Outside of that, well, there is metallic inks as well as you can see in like silver. That just looks kind of weird. Outside of that, they are standard. If you don't like that style of deck, well, that style of court card, you're not going to like this deck. So, there's that. Basically, a five of spades reveal there. And the number cards are all completely standard as well. Um, obviously, bicycle stock, Ericus and Venus, printed by USB-C. This one, I think, is their first one printed by USB-C. The previous ones were printed by Expert, I believe. I could be wrong. Could be a little bit mistaken on that, but feel something. I think I might have seen something like that. It's a nice stock and finish. Handles pretty good. I'll give it. I'll give it a B. It's a nice enough deck. It's probably not going to be on the top of anyone's list, <laughs> but it's nice enough. There's some cool gaff cards and obviously some tricks you can learn. So that is that. Comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know what you think. We'll see you next time for more. Thanks for watching.